All right, ready guys? NCAA tournament, the madness has begun tonight. All right, so here we go. Let's start with the playing games. I know it picks pickums and in most brackets, they just have the whoever winner versus whoever, but just for the hell of it, always pick them. So let's start with Howard versus Wagner. I'll go with uh, Wagner here. This is how I usually do it when I'm doing the bracket. I just circle them. All right, so we got Wagner. And then the other 16 versus 16, uh, go with Montana State. And then this one, Virginia versus Colorado. All right, Jordo, ready? Wow, wow, Jordo, wow, wow, Virginia. All right, and this one, Boise State. We have Broncos versus Colorado Buffs. Taking Colorado. And this one, those are your playing game. There's your playing game wins. So that those are the ones I'm going to have in the brackets. So here we go. Let's continue. All right. Start with the East. We're doing region by region. Let's go with the East. All right. So this will be this will be 32. This will be the Sweet 16. This will be eight. All right, so the first one is gonna be, go with uh, go with Connecticut here, move over here. And then with this one, oh, can't see me. This is from, always go with the nine and the eight nine. That's my personal thing there. So let's say uh, Northwestern wins there. All right, next one is this game here. And I'm going to go with, uh, uh, I think I'll stick with San Diego State. And the 5-12 and the five twelve game there. All right. The next one is going to be Auburn-Yale. Auburn is the best four seed in the tournament, I believe. And they're going to win this. Right, so I got chalk so far. BYU Duquesne. BYU has been a very overrated team all season long. I like Duquesne winning this one. Illinois Morehead State. Now, in afternoon trivia, the opening round today was NFL QB's alma maters. And in that round, now I had no idea, but one of the quarterbacks that I mentioned was Phil Sims. Moorhead State, Andy got that one. The clincher was Jeff George, Illinois, and Free Jack got it. Incredible. Two of those schools going head to head. You know who's going to win this one? I like Illinois to win this one. All right, into 7 10. This is easy. I believe that uh, Drake is really good. They've got uh, they've got their, I think their coach's name is DeBreeze. His son is really good. So watch for them. They took out Indiana State. And I like, uh, I like Drake to win this game. Yeah, Drake. All right, last one is Iowa State, South Dakota State. And I'm going to go with Iowa State in this one to win. You see. All right, let's go to the round of 32. UConn Northwestern. Like UConn makes it to the 16, wins that one, and then the next one, Auburn San Diego State. Like I said, I really like Auburn, so I'm gonna go with them to make it to the 16. Next we have Duquesne and Illinois. All right, so Duquesne and Illinois. Who? What do we go with here, guys? So I'm not really sure to go with here. Uh, I'll tell you what, I'm going to go with uh, Duquesne to win. Duquesne, about with the upset over Illinois, three knocked out. Iowa State and uh, Washington State versus Drake. 
Well, tell you what, guys, in this game, I'm going to have to go with Drake to win. So, two big upset games here. All right, so in the Elite Eight, Elite Eight, uh, this is going to be a good matchup. Auburn's going to give UConn a, a hell of a game, but the Huskies are going to win this game. And then down here, Duquesne and Drake. Drake, the 10 seed, advances to the Elite Eight. There we go. Drake and UConn. All right, in the and I'll get to who wins that one when we get to the Elite Eights. All right, check out the West. This one is, I believe, fairly easy bracket. So the first one is going to be Wagner, of course, the plan, loses to North Carolina. Next is the Mississippi State and Michigan State. This is Mississippi State. Duck, not Missouri State. Whereas Michigan State, again, take the nine, especially when it's Michigan State. <laughs> Definitely take them. All right, St. Mary's Grand Canyon. Uh, Grand Canyon, what? Is that the first time they've ever, they've ever made it? Um, some of these I'm looking at for the first time. So St. Mary's is in advances to 32. Uh, all right, so one team here that uh, I'm a little worried about is Alabama. They play, they don't play good defense. They try to outscore teams, but they're going to be able to take out Charleston, so I'll go with Alabama in this game. And then Clemson, I like Clemson to win over New Mexico. And the 314, the Bears, uh, can they win? Yeah, I'm going to go with the Baylor Bears here. All right, uh, Dayton and Nevada. Uh, Dayton and Nevada. I'm going to go with uh, take Nevada and win. 10 seed, and then go with Arizona. The two seed to beat Long Beach State. All right. Going to the Sweet 16, UNC advances, Cheating Heels. Next one is St. Mary's, Alabama. Um, I'll go with St. Mary's. Like I said, I don't like the Alabama defense. And then in this game, uh, Clemson Baylor. I like Clemson to win. Next one is Arizona and Nevada. Arizona, the two seed gets through. All right. North Carolina to the eight. Takes out St. Mary's and the, the Clemson and Arizona. I like Clemson to win. Tigers take out the Wildcats. Battle of the Cats. So we'll have UNC Clemson. That's the West. All right, next, we're going to move on to the South region. And here it is, boys. Here it is. All right. This is the top right on your bracket, by the way. It just flipped around. All right, Houston Cougars versus the first Virginia school, Longwood University from far, uh, out in Farmville, Virginia. The Lancers in the tournament this time. Anyone remember Jerome Kersey, the great Portland Trailblazer forward? Went to a couple of finals with them and then got a ring with Dewey Spurs in 1999. Jerome Kersey, may he rest in peace, went to Longwood. But it's going to be uh, Houston winning that one. And then in the 8 9. Got to go with the number nine seed when the all-Texas matchup coming in round 32. 
Wisconsin versus another Virginia team, James Madison from Harrisonburg, Virginia. Guess who, guess who wins this one, guys? Do the Badgers win? Hell no. James Madison with the upset. Duke and Vermont. All right, so Duke and Vermont. This is going to be uh, Duke playing this one. They're not a great team, a pretty good team. Texas Tech and NC State. Teddy, can they do it? Teddy and others were saying during the ACC tournament that the Wolfpack were getting tired and they were going to run out of steam, and they never did. And they want here. That's right, Teddy. NC State. Ace! NC State wins, gets to the 32. Kentucky, Oakland. The NC State will be praying for Oakland, but it's not going to happen because Kentucky is going to win this one. Nesky's team. Remember her? Florida, Colorado. Colorado, one of the playing teams. Colorado wins this. I kind of like them. Marquette and Western Kentucky. It's like Western Kentucky always gets in. But Marquette is going to win this. Going to win this one. All right. Round of 16. To get to the round of 16, Houston, Texas A&M. Got to go with Houston, number one seed, advances. And then in this game, you have the Dukes, the JMU Dukes, taking out Duke. That's right. JMU advances, baby. Oh, uh, College of Scotty Norwood, Shock. Charles Haley, Hall of Famer, the great Redskins receiver, Gary Clark, JMU. All right, next one is going to be NC State and Kentucky. This is where NC State runs out of gas. Kentucky wins. And then in the next one, I really like, um, I really like Marquette in this bracket. They're just that annoying team every year that you just can't get rid of. Houston and JMU. I'm going to go with Houston to win this one. Get to the Elite Eight. And the other Elite Eight team will be Kentucky. I like Calipari's team to get to a big matchup. Elite Eight weekend versus Houston. That's the South. It's going to the Last region, which is the Midwest. Guys, ready? All right, here we go. Here we go. Midwest, all right. Purdue. Wins the first game. Utah State, TCU. Go with TCU, the nine seed, of course. Gonzaga, McNeese. McNeese with the big upset. Kansas, Sanford. Kansas wins. All right. Let's go to the 6 11 game. South Carolina, Oregon. Go with South Carolina. And then Creighton Akron. I like uh, Creighton for no other reason but Creighton Duke from Jason Goes to Hell, the final Friday, 1993. Creighton Duke. All right, Texas versus Virginia. I think the Longhorns win here, right? Actually, no. Say it with me, Jordan. On three. One, two, three. Wah, wah! Virginia. Virginia. Wahoo wah, Jordo. Wahoo wah. All right, let's go on to the uh, 215. Wahoo wah, Jordo. All right, 215. How the heck can I not pick St. Peter's, right? Peter's. Peter's. 
Tennessee wins this one. All right, so Tennessee. And then to get to the 16, let's go with uh, Purdue. So I win here. All right. And then McNeese, and then Kansas. Oh, look, guys. Upset alert. Good D. Uh, I'm going to go with McNeese. Take out Kansas here. Why not? Next one is uh, Creighton. And this one, I'm going to go with Tennessee. <laughs> no, why? Who lied? This one. All right. Let's go with um, Purdue gets through. I know everyone's saying that like Purdue chokes a lot, and they have recently, but they're gonna do some, they're gonna do more damage in this tournament than before, so. The Boilers. All right, let's go with uh, Creighton, Tennessee. Creighton again, Creighton, Duke. Could we have Creighton versus Duke in the final? Oh, that'd be great, Creighton, Duke. Purdue and Creighton are the last, are the last two from the uh, Midwest. And now let's get to the Elite Eight. All right, guys. Here we go. Econ and Drake. Huge lopsided one here. Yukon wins. And then to get to the Final Four, Clemson versus North Carolina. Yeah, let's go to this one first. Houston and Kentucky. Kentucky's defense has been very inconsistent. The other number one makes it. And then over here, Purdue versus Creighton. This is where Purdue falls. There we go. And then the heels, the cheating heels in the ACC matchup. They fall to Clemson. All right. This is our final four. We got three ones. We got a one here. And then we got one here. We got three here. Always chalk. Always do it, it seems like. All right, Yukon versus North Carolina. Yukon. Let me do it this way. Yukon wins, and then Houston Creighton. Houston. Yukon and Houston, the final championship, April 8th on TBS, cable for you skanks out there. All right, Yukon is the favorite to win this whole thing. And so the final score is gonna be Connecticut Huskies put up, uh, let's say 81. And then Hugh Tons with Akeem the Dream and Clyde in the stands, propel them to victory, 83. That's your final uh, in championship. Houston wins. I picked Houston a couple of years ago, and they let me down big. I'm going to go back to the well. I'm going to have a win in a big heavyweight fight this in the championship. Houston, 83, UConn, 81, thanks to watching. General Peters saying, have a great, enjoy the tournament, drink responsibly. Hope your teams win. And best of luck in Pips Pickums March Madness tournament. All right. Peace out. Wow, wow.